this just kind of takes your breath away. It's a, practically a card you'd swear shouldn't exist. It's it's unbelievable uh, what this represents. It's one of the coolest designs of all time. It's a laser cut wooden card. There's actually depth to the um, uh, to the text here, which we can show as we zoom in. Uh, but you know, so cool in its its creativity. But it's one of these all important dual immortal cards uh, featuring Kobe and Jordan. Uh, and then obviously the fact that it's a dual autograph and hand numbered, there's only 25 of these ever made. So it's 24 of 25, uh, if that weren't enough, look at the technical grade. I mean, my goodness, uh, pristine designation, corners of a nine, five, everything else a 10, uh, autographs are given a 10 designation. This is just an irreplaceably cool and important offering. It's one of the best cards issued during the decade. Uh, and certainly one of our favorites. And this is just a special piece. I mentioned the laser cutting. You can see the, you know, how these letters literally like, they come out of the card. Same thing with like the upper deck, like um, labeling, like those letterings are like risen out of the cavity that the, that was cut into. This is a card you just sit there and you stare at for a while. It doesn't get old. From the back, very similar to the front, but obviously there's there's no circulation to share. This is just a beautiful card featuring Jordan shortly after his retirement and then coming back to play with the Wizards and then the heir apparent and Kobe. It's quite a card, quite a piece of history.